my gosh, thank you. Ah, I, I didn't expect everything to be so active today. Ah! <laughs> Hi. Um, how's everyone doing? So, okay. So, I... I <laughs> There, okay, there are a ton of uh, first time chatters in here. Ah, thank you for the sub. The, oh, bleh, <coughs> hey! Ah, hey! There's, <laughs> there's, oh, there's a lot of first time uh, chatters in here, which I am very, uh, <coughs> very happy to see. Um, I thank you for the hype trade and thank you, Zester. <laughs> um, I'm assuming a bunch of you came from uh, the video that I posted a few days ago, and <laughs> why are you redeeming? <laughs> Marmy, Marmy, you're back again, back at it again, Marmy, insane. Ah, thank you. So, uh, man, I didn't, I didn't expect to get uh, pummeled with stuff already, but you know what? It's fine, it's fine. I didn't, I didn't really set like a like a limit on it. Um. Uh, yeah, I, uh, <laughs> even though I've been streaming technically for like a few weeks before, before today, <laughs> um, I, I'm still really nervous. Um, I think because today is the, the official debut stream, which, okay, I know it's like not as hype because every, you all know what my model looks like, right? You know what it oh, thank you. Congratulations on the debut stream. Thank you. I have been waiting for this day to come. Like, I've had this model ready. Oh, thank you, Gua Vanity. I've had this model bleh, I've had this model ready for <laughs> I didn't I didn't think that you guys would redeem the the bully waitress thing so many times. Alright, um <laughs> Um, I've been, I've been, oh, <laughs> get a helmet, Emily. <laughs> oh, wait, maybe, maybe, maybe I should have put a limit on this. I, I didn't think everyone would have so many channel points already. You, you guys don't want, to, you guys don't want to spend it on other stuff. <laughs> Okay. All right. Um. Later. Later on, if uh, if if it gets a little too crazy, I might have to turn it off for a bit. Um. I, didn't, I wasn't expecting this many. Ow. Um. But yes. Uh. You know what? Maybe. Maybe I'll turn. You know what? I won't turn it off. It's. It's fine. Um. But thank you guys for. <laughs> thank you. Thank you guys for coming so much. Um. I'm really happy to see you guys here. And uh, I, I lost my train of thought a few times. And uh, I hope I hope you guys are having a good day. Um. Uh, right. So I didn't have anything super crazy planned for today. Uh, you know, if you're expecting uh, booby levels of like in insane debut like intro uh, d d theatrics, that's not gonna happen. I it's a very simple, <laughs> very <laughs> it's a very simple um, chill stream today, and it's gonna be kind of short because uh, I don't have any games planned today. I'm just I'm just here to officially debut this model and sort of like tell you the the story behind how this came to be so okay give me one second let me just oh. all right oh my goodness hold on let me just i'm really small i mean i'm really big let me let me move over to the corner here so okay this is <laughs> i have a little presentation um oh thank you okay I have a little presentation prepared, um, oh, and uh, it's it's gonna be like a little slideshow. It looks like a menu, <laughs> and uh, this graphic was actually made by Shy Starfall. So thank you, Shy, for the the wonderful presentation graphic. But <laughs> hey, <laughs> um, 
Yes. But uh, so basically, I'm okay. I know that like traditionally, like VTubers are supposed to like sort of play completely different characters and like have like their own lore and stories. But um, I, I feel like if I tried to like pretend to be another character, it just wouldn't work because people are sort of used to how my voice sounds and uh, YouTube is my main uh, platform. Oh, thank you for the 100 bits, Taskmaster. Uh, so I decided to make the lore for this VTuber. Uh, basically my YouTube persona's part-time job. Um, so hold on. I know the, the alerts make it a little difficult to see. But the lore is basically, making videos is a lot of fun, and I love drawing more than anything else in the world, but it can get pretty lonely, with it being a mostly solo activity and all. Maybe I need a fun part-time job. And then, y you know, uh, I basically the lore is, I wanted to work in a strawberry cafe, because I love- <coughs> Because I love strawberries. Um, but also, I, I, I just enjoy having that extra bit of like social interaction in my life. Uh, since I don't get it that much from just sitting and drawing all day. So, and also like streaming is something that I have been pretty interested in and it's been a lot of fun so far. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, so it won't be like a super like role play uh, stream or anything, you know, aside from the whole like, welcome to the cafe, y you know, like, what would you like to order? Uh, <laughs> and, um, let me, let me, let me, let me just... For those of you who are new and want to see the whole design, you can take a look over here. So this is... Hold on. This is my face. Um, I'll get to, I'll get to the credits in the, in a few slides over. But, uh, I think it turned out really cute. Um... I love the, the 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 shimmer in the eyes and, and the way they like bounce a little bit, <laughs> and and <laughs> um and then I really like how um bouncy the hair is. Uh, some people have told me that they think that the model sort of does not suit my personality because it looks like way too elegant. And um yeah, I can see exactly what they're talking about. <laughs> uh, I like it a lot. I love the buns especially. <laughs> And, um, let me show you the expressions. I, like, forget to use the expressions a lot, so let me just... Oh. <laughs> so this is the heart eyes expression. Ah, hearts. And, um, those of you who have, like, been in my, like, very first stream ever, like, this is all gonna feel like deja vu to you, but, uh, you, I ho hope you can sit through it for <laughs> a little while longer. Um, this is the, uh, teary-eyed expression i don't really <laughs> don't hit me i don't have to use this one um very often i i don't know when i would but you know i just i thought it was cute and then ah, and then wow we had the sparkly eye expression and i'm like really enamored by stuff and this is the scared expression which i'll probably use tomorrow oh Thank you for the five gifted. I mean, I mean, thank you for the five gifted. <laughs> um, but yeah, I will probably use that for like horror games and stuff. And actually, I'm gonna play my uh my first horror game on stream. Well, it's not my first horror game ever, but it's my first like streamed horror game, which is Phasmophobia tomorrow. Ah, oh, thank you, Senpai, for the five gifted. And then if you wanna see oh, but right in the neck and then this is the outfit i have like a, a like a choker th <laughs> a choker thing with uh strawberries and this is the rest of the outfit and and <laughs> and these are my boots you can't tell but they're sort of um they're supposed to be like healed in the back but just like a little bit not too much So inside we need the ugly crying Emily. Yeah, you know what? I need to. I need to. I need to get that at some point. Just like a re like I toggle it. And it's just a horror, horror, horrifically ugly, crying face. Okay, are you guys ready for the next slide? Okay, let me just, let me just move myself over. Okay, ha 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 ha. I wanna, I wanna make sure I'm not 
too big so I don't cover up anything important. All right, next slide. One second. Where is... Ah, here we go. Okay. Oh, you can't see the art credit? Okay. I'll go right in the middle. There you go. Yes, this lovely art was drawn by Molly Ce Molly Cecilia? Cecilia? It's gorgeous. Mm, okay. Next up. We are going to Okay, I'll cover up this screen for a second. Just for just for a moment so we can pay attention to the one on on the on the left. Uh, we're going to discuss my likes and dislikes just briefly. You know, we don't we don't have to get too into it. Oh, I've also seen some people ask why my eyes are blue instead of uh, the usual brown I draw myself with and my natural eye color. Uh, so, okay, it's pretty simple. I figured like brown eyes like just wouldn't fit very well with the whole color scheme of like red and green. Ah! Um, and I thought blue was a nice color, but also I, I do wear colored contacts in my day to day life. Not necessarily blue. It's, it's mostly um, gray. I wear a lot of gray contacts. But I thought blue would fit nicely uh, with the model. Um, but yeah, I know some people were wondering why I didn't go for like the black and white color scheme. And uh, it's it's because I just I thought it was too simple of an outfit. Uh, <laughs> I've seen some people be like, oh, I, I kind of wish you went for the black and white outfit. And, and I understand that. But I don't know. I kind of wanted to go for a specific theme. Okay. Yeah, I know. I know you guys are flaming me for not liking chocolate. Okay. I just, I don't, I don't like chocolate. Um, I actually, okay. So I guess, you know what? We'll discuss the dislikes first because you guys seem to be really fixated on the chocolate thing. So, <laughs> I just, okay. I've never really liked chocolate or like any like crazy sweet things, which is kind of ironic because my whole thing is like, I work in a strawberry sweets cafe. <laughs> but you know, maybe that's for the better because then I won't eat everything in the kitchen. Right. And I can properly serve you. But uh, yeah, I don't like like mega sweet things, um, which includes chocolate. I don't like cheesecake. And I, you know, anything that is just like super, super rich. I like, uh, I like very light sweet things. Um, and I also don't like spicy food. <laughs> um, I, I, I just, I can't, I can't. Ah! Was that for the chocolate thing? Yeah, I don't like spicy food. <laughs> And, uh, I, I don't like horror in any, you know, and in any, in any kind. Like, I don't like horror movies, so I never watch them. Um, and I don't like horror games. Like, I'll, I'll play, I mean, I'll watch people play horror games, but, um, you know, I, I like to live vicariously through other people's fear. Don't necessarily enjoy feeling that fear myself. What about chocolate strawberries? I do like chocolate covered strawberries, but, um, I don't like it when the chocolate shell is like super thick. Uh, so I I actually prefer strawberries with Nutella because I feel like I don't know Nutella tastes less intense than like actual chocolate. Um, technology. Okay, I know this. That sounds weird, considering that my entire life is on the internet. What I mean by that is I hate I, I hate trying to figure out technology. For instance. I would not have been able to like put this stream together on my own simply because like I I just I don't know how. And like when people get new equipment, they get really excited, right? To to like put it together. When I get new equipment, I am dreading the setup experience because I feel like I am going to like I, f I feel like I'm going to I'm going to mess it up and I'm going to like break something. So <laughs> that's why we have the boomer emote. <laughs> um, yeah, because uh, I am, I'm just, I'm not, I'm not good with technology. I like to blame my parents. They were never very tech savvy. So um, yeah, I, I, I blame them. But also, I don't know. It's just, it's, it's difficult. You know, Does that, can anyone relate or is everyone just like really good at it? <laughs> uh, if you've been here since like the beginning of me streaming, you've witnessed all of my like technological plunders. Um, let's see. Uh, someone said, "Wait, oh no, you know what? Chat's going too fast. I can't, I can't stop on anything." Um, I also hate bugs. Um, I don't really have to explain that one. If I, I don't know anyone that genuinely likes bugs, except for maybe Moon. 
And I don't like imitation crab, which I know is like really specific in this list of things I dislike, but it's just, it's one, it's one of the few things I refuse to eat if I see it like on the menu. Like whenever I get sushi, you know when you like get sushi with your friends and you look at the section of the rolls and they just, uh, they like half of the rolls just all have imitation crab in them or like crab with a K. I, I avoid those. I immediately gloss over those because I just, I hate the way imitation crab tastes. However, I love real crab. Real crab is delicious, but um, very expensive. <laughs> so I don't eat it very often. Uh, someone said, when is the signing? If you're talking about my, uh, like, streamily poster signing, that's on March 7th at, uh, I think it was 12 p.m. I'm gonna have to double check, but it was either 12 or 12.30 p.m. Um, let's see. Uh, okay. And then also the last thing is I hate being alone. Um, for, for, I mean, most of you probably know already, I'm, I'm pretty extroverted and I don't enjoy just, like, being by myself not necessarily okay well like i'm ah, i'm fine with being by myself when i'm like drawing and like working and stuff but like i could never i could never like live by myself um i would i'd get lonely very quickly uh but yeah that's why that's why i have roommates <laughs> um and then we'll just we'll just briefly go through my likes because those are a lot more predictable than the dislike section. I like drawing a lot because um, it's one of the only few things that I know how to do. Um, I like naps. I like tea parties, which is partly why I went for a cafe inspired theme. Um, I like cats. Uh, I really like garlicky food. Um, I love Christmas music. <laughs> I, I'm I'm one of those people who like ne who can't get sick of Christmas music. I mean, I'll get sick of like a few Christmas songs, but in general, I, I I love it when it's December and all the stores start playing Christmas music. I love it. I know it's like it's pretty specific, and I really like animated films. Um, yeah. Okay, let's move over to specifically in my favorites. Okay, what's your Meyer Briggs? I think the last time I took the test, I was like. Uh, ESFJ or something? It was E something. I actually can't remember. I can't. <laughs> um, so my favorite color, as you m could probably tell, is, uh, pink! Yep, that was, you know, I probably, I didn't even have to put that one down. That, that was obvious. Um, and my favorite food is sushi and udon, but also French onion soup. Uh, French onion soup is one of those things where if I see it on the menu at any restaurant, I have to order it. Uh, so I've had many uh, mediocre French onion soups, and um, I've had really good French onion soup. It's it's like a big hit or miss. Like it's yeah. Um, and then let's see. <laughs> Someone's <laughs> Riru Pink. No way. <laughs> Thank you. Um. Oh my God. Wait. Okay. No. 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 All right. All right. All right. I'm not trying to get. I'm not trying to get big. Okay, uh, my favorite dessert. Um, so okay, here here are the sweets that I do actually like. I like creme brulee and macarons, um, but I'm actually really picky with macarons. I think I've only ever like, there's only like two places where I really like the macarons, and otherwise they're usually like way too sweet or I don't like the filling. Um, and my favorite drink is vanilla iced coffee, and I'm actually drinking some right now. Uh, Someone said, so I'm rewatching Rocco's Modern Life on DVD since it was my favorite as a kid. Do you have a favorite show you'd like to revisit? Oh, you guys heard that Arthur ended recently, right? Um, I actually watched like the, the last scene in the last episode of Arthur and I cried <laughs> because it's a show that I, I loved so much when I was younger and it was just like the, the nostalgic feelings just came like flooding back to me and like I didn't realize how much I loved that show um, until I saw like the ending and it was that feeling of like oh my god these characters all like grew up and like I grew up too and like they grew up with me basically like ah! <laughs> it was really nice um, my favorite fruits are strawberries and mangoes, and my favorite genre, like, uh, I guess specifically anime, is, uh, comedy and maho shoujo. Um, but you guys knew that already. 
Um, okay, let me... Let's take a look at the, at the next slide. Oh, okay, okay. We're gonna get into my goals. Um, I've noticed that like people put like a whole side of their personal goals. Um, so I was like, okay, I'll, I'll create one too because I actually do have a bunch of goals. So my goals for, I guess this, uh, yeah, I guess these are my New Year's resolutions. My New Year's resolutions are uh, have fun. Um, I wanted to try streaming because it seemed fun and I've been having fun and I don't want to do anything that like to the point where I feel like it becomes a chore or like I'm forced to do it. So that, that's partly why I'm streaming only like a few times a week just cause like I don't want to overwhelm myself. And I've been having a lot of fun, uh, especially today. <laughs> Yo, you achieved your first goal, let's go. <laughs> Thank you. Um, my second goal is to get better at drawing. Um, but that's my goal every year. So that's not anything new. Even even if I get better this year, it's gonna still be my goal next year. So that one is just, it's just perpetually there. Uh, number three is learn more recipes. Um, I made some, I made some, you guys might've seen it, uh, but I made some strawberry scones like two weeks ago for a tea party. And uh, I was really proud of myself and it was really tasty. And uh, I want to, I guess maybe bake more because baking is a little difficult, but also just in general, just like learn more recipes. Um, and then uh, number four, I wanna watch more stuff. Uh, you guys know I, I am known for having not watched a single damn thing in my entire life, and I wanna fix that. <laughs> um, I've actually been watching uh, a bunch of stuff this year. I decided this year I want to actually like keep up with some of the like newer anime that I'm interested in because last year I think the only thing I really kept up with was like Fruits Basket and then I like I picked up a few things but then dropped them immediately uh so someone said like Avatar for example yeah and it was a really good experience um uh yeah I want to watch a bunch of I want to watch everything well maybe not everything but just <laughs> just more things <laughs> um number five get better at games because I'm bad. That's about it. That's not, you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to expand on that. I just want to get better because <laughs> I know, I know it can get a little like frustrating or amusing to watch me play games. Um, and then my very last and most important goal, well, aside from having fun is make good YouTube videos. Um, I really enjoy making videos and I want to continue like making, ah, <laughs> I want to continue like making as many as I can, but making sure I love each and every single one. Um, yeah, that's about it for my goals. Let's move on to the next slide. Um, what do we have here? Ah, okay. This is my, uh, tentative scheduling. Um, I, th I've been keeping up with it for the past few weeks. So, and like, I, I kind of like it. I like having a break in between days, but it's going to be typically Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, uh, either 12 or 12.30 PM. But if I'm doing collabs with people who are in different time zones, you know, obviously I'll have to like meet them halfway. And like, you know, some days I might stream uh, in the afternoon, but also uh, I might stream like late night just for fun, like a, like a spontaneous secret stream. But yes, uh, as, as you see here, YouTube videos take priority. Um, I'm not trying to make a platform switch or anything. Uh, I, I, yeah, YouTube, YouTube videos, priority. <laughs> as in like, as much as I will try and stream like my video making prog progress, uh, if, if there's like a week where I just really have to grind on a video, I probably won't stream that day just cause like, I don't want to have to worry about like entertaining chat while I'm like working on a video and like sweating over it. So, um, uh, if there's any, if there's ever a week where I just don't have anything scheduled, it's probably because I'm working on a video and the deadline is drawing closer. Ah, sorry. Oh my God. I'm gonna spill my coffee. <clears throat> okay. And then hashtags for, uh, I guess, fan art in, uh, in particular. I was thinking um, it could either be Emery Lust, like 
Emily illustrations or just hashtag Emerichu because that is my username. So um, if you ever want to draw fan art or you just want to like tag me in something, you can use that hashtag and I'll go through it. Um, because a lot of times people will like at me on fan art and then I will miss it uh, because it'll get buried in my notifications. So yeah, you can use these too. And um, I didn't have like a fan name. I don't, I don't think I would ever use it. Um, I don't know what like customers, cafe patrons, like we don't, we don't really need one, honestly. Uh, but yeah, just consider yourselves <laughs> my cafe patrons. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. I thought that first one was for special art. No, 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 no. That's that's for <laughs> it's 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 supposed to be like my username and then also illustrations like mashed together. I may have made a mistake. Um, just <laughs> to clarify, it's it's for illustrations. <laughs> <laughs> um all right you know we're, we're gonna move on we're gonna move on <laughs> uh ah yes oh i was waiting for this we're gonna go through my credits so my uh the 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 artist my mom that drew the model art is sasachi 95 and she's been an artist on the internet for quite some time now. I've been following her for quite some time now. And um, honestly, she is the only reason why I uh, decided to do this. Thank you, Marmy. Yeah, um, because so, OK, I, I told this story already in my very first stream. But since there's a lot of new people, I'm going to tell it again. <coughs> oh, thank you for the thousand bits. So... <laughs> The, the, I originally, um, when I fell into the VTuber hole, uh, gradually, um, I was like, man, it'd be so much fun to be like a cute 2D girl and like stream, but I do YouTube and like, I, I'm just gonna like stay in my own lane because I don't know, I, I, I don't think I would do a very good job. And then, um... One day, uh, Sasachi on Twitter opened up commissions and she was like, hey, I'm opening up um, VTuber model commissions. If anyone's interested, I have one slot open. And then I DM'd her immediately <laughs> because I knew that if I were to get any model made, I wanted it to be drawn by her because Sasachi is one of my favorite artists and I really admire her art a ton. So thank you, Sasu. And then Kira Omori is the uh, rigging artist for this model. And she was actually recommended to me by Sasu. So, uh, you know, their powers combined made this. Okay, um, we're gonna move over to the other credits. Bum, bum, bum. Okay. Oh, thank you, Marmy. Can you read Japanese? No, I can't. Um. Uh, so my alerts, my very cute alerts that you have been seeing all stream are done by Sora Hanayo. Um, her stuff is incredible. She she went like above and beyond with these alerts. Like, I, I can't thank her enough. Her work is amazing. Hana, I don't know if you're here, but if you are, uh, I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Your, your work is amazing. The alerts are so cute. I know. I love them. Thank you. Uh, the background music that you heard in the starting soon screen and this screen right now is done by uh, Uta Live Pro. Uh, I commissioned them um, to make like a sort of like cafe-ish sounding background music and they did an incredible job and it gets stuck in my head. Um, let's see. My starting soon screen animation is done by Keijo OEE88 and I've actually recently commissioned them to animate my um what is it my ending screen animation uh you'll probably see the static image of that at the end of this stream but I want it to like you know have a little bit of movement and then the starting soon graphic and the graphic for this uh menu presentation is done by Shy Starfall uh thank you Shy appreciate you tons um he actually he, he got this menu thing done for me on very short notice so i appreciate that a lot and uh, nachos arts did the starting soon art that you saw at the very beginning where i was holding the cake and it said starting soon 
um, her work is also incredible. Uh, so please, please check her out. Her work is phenomenal. Um, I, I, I love the way she colors. And my background, uh, well, you can't really see it, but you saw it earlier. Um, my, my, my background, my cafe background is done by Amorphia One. And I'm actually, I actually also commissioned an art, another artist to do a background of like the um, cafe table. So I, it, it could look like I'm like sitting with you. <laughs> I figured I could use it for some other just chatting streams. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on, I need to drink some water. Give me a second. Blech. Okay. Let's see. Um, moving on to I like forget which which um which stuff comes next. Oh, ah, okay, okay, okay. So, all right, all right. This is one of the reasons why I held off on my debut stream until today. Ow! <laughs> until today. Um, so I wanted to hit a uh, affiliate before I actually did a debut stream because well first off I wanted to get like a bit more um streaming experience but also I wanted to be able to use emotes um and they came out so cute okay so I actually am not able to use all of these just yet um I think there's like nine available and then I'll open up more later but these are the ones I have so far uh, it's, it's really cute. Um, <laughs> where is my Pepe Emmy? I know, I know, I know. I'll add it, I'll add it, don't worry. Um, but it's just, I don't have any slots right now. Um, do I get more slots when I hit partner? Or if I hit partner? Road to partner, let's go. But these are all done by Krabby, and her work is absolutely amazing. Um, she also did my panels, which you can see on my about page, uh, and my sub badges. Uh, I love her art. It's so gorgeous. Um, you guys might be wondering, like, why don't you draw any of your own assets? And I'm, you know, I do that already for YouTube. I, I just kind of, <laughs> I, I just want to commission a bunch of artists I really admire for uh, my Twitch channel in particular. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, moving on. Oh, so these are my original sketches. There we go. Now you can see some of my art. Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, this is the sketch that I sent Sasu. Can you can you believe that she took this like really quick sketch and just turned it into this? I oh, thank you, Sasu. It's so beautiful. Um. But yeah, this was, I, okay, here's the other thing that's funny. When I and reached out to Sasu to commission a model, I had no freaking clue what design I wanted. All I knew was that I wanted it to be drawn by her. <laughs> so um, when I first reached out to her, oh, who rigged the model? It was Kira Omori. Um, but when I first reached out to her, she was like, okay, cool. Yeah, we could get started. Um... Do you know what design you want to do? And I was like, no. Can you give me like a week? And so I brainstormed and I knew I wanted to do something strawberry themed. <laughs> I just realized the white stuff on the sleeves were strawberry sweet seeds. What else would they be? Uh, but yeah, those are, this is the original uh, sketches. Um, we got some healed booties that you'll never see. Uh, we got a strawberry choker and a sketch of the strawberry garter as well and then over here is a possible casual like date outfit maybe i don't have any plans to like get a new outfit just yet because i've i've barely like started you know with this model and i want to use it as much as i can but um yeah this is a a potential um uh what should i call it the casual outfit and you might note uh, <laughs> and uh you might notice that it features um uh jewelry from be so lovely which because i did a strawberry themed collab with them uh not too long ago so yeah okay moving on 
One second. But why don't you have the bag? Because I'm on my shift right now. I'm working. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> um, the skirts, frills, or chef's kiss? Thank you. I wanted them to resemble uh, strawberry leaves. I just thought it'd be cute. Um, I have no idea what's going on with the random objects, but it's hilarious. Oh, the thrown objects. Um, that, That's actually a channel point redeem. I just didn't expect people to redeem so many of them. <laughs> And if you want to throw a hundred at me, you can for 25,000 channel points. So, yeah. <laughs> um, next up. Oh, oh, my last slide. Okay. We have some special thanks to, uh, to, to, <laughs> to dish out. Okay. Special thanks to my mods, of course. Uh, my mods have been super sweet. And also, uh, thank you to everyone who... <laughs> who applied to be a mod um i ended up picking around i think like nine mods and they've all been super sweet super helpful um they're in the chat right now uh love you guys lots oh thank you for the sub also special thanks to connor uh also known as sea dog va because he actually helps me a lot with my um with like, you know, because I'm not good with technology, he helped me a lot with like figuring out the settings for my Go XLR and my like mic settings. Ah! <laughs> um, so uh, thank you, Connor. Um, he's asleep right now, but uh, I appreciate him very much. Ah! Um, Connor was actually one of my very first YouTube friends, and um, you know, he he's very he's very dear to me, and I appreciate him. An other, and another big and another uh, big thank you to Chili Panda, who was also one of my first YouTube friends. Um, you know, they go way back. Uh, uh, Chili helped me a lot with like just figuring out stream stuff, like helping me like set up stuff with like my my alerts and uh, ow <laughs> and uh, just. I don't, even, I don't even know what to say. Like, she helped me so much. Um, I appreciate, appreciate you a lot, Chili. Uh, and she has been rooting for me since I even, like, considered, like, making a VTuber thing. So, thank you. And also, uh, thank you to my viewers, of course. Uh, thank you for showing up to this debut stream. Um... <laughs> And and also I'd like to I'd like to thank the viewers who like maybe who aren't really like jazzed about the idea of VTubers or like maybe they're not interested in it, but they were still like, you know what? I wish you luck and I wish you the best. And I appreciate that. Because there were a, a there there was a small group of people who I think just have like a huge hate boner for VTubers for some reason. But you know, some people were really disappointed when they found out that I wanted to stream with the vtuber model but i don't know i i felt like this was a very like emily move no like uh i i draw myself 2d anyway like i figured with streaming i probably would still do t 2d no but um please don't call it hate boner oh i'm so sorry i, I won't say that okay i'll say great disdain great dislike uh but um you know even if you're it's not really for you thank you for you know, coming up, coming out, and uh, giving it a chance, and popping into my stream, just to see what it's about. I don't want anyone to feel obligated uh, to have to, like, show up to my streams. Like, if if you don't show up to my streams, it doesn't mean you're that you're not, like, a good supporter or anything. It just, like, this is just something I'm doing for fun. Um... If all you if all you want to do is like watch my videos, that is also fine, and I appreciate you for it. So thank you. Um, do I have anything else? Oh no, that's about it. Okay, so let me just move this out of the way. Uh, yeah. Wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That was the end of my presentation. It was a lot shorter than I expected. Um. But let me see, let me see what's going on in chat, because I haven't been able to look in chat very often. Um 
Who made the background? Amorphia1 on Twitter. Amorphia1. Um, also, if you missed any of like the credits that I mentioned, they will also be listed on my about page. Uh, so if you're like super curious about who did what, you can just check the about page and I have it like neatly organized for you. Um, so I have a deep suspicion she likes strawberry. Really? What gave it away? <laughs> <laughs> um, what's your favorite anime? Uh, okay, if I had to think like top three, definitely Nichijo, um, Cardcaptor Sakura, <laughs> and Fruits Basket. <laughs> uh, let's see, okay. Oh, I guess, you know what, maybe I should make this like an official announcement too. So if you follow me on Instagram or Twitter, then you might have seen this yesterday, but I am actually doing a, um... I th like a signing event with Streamily. Uh, so I'm like, there, yeah, I'm selling like three different posters that I'll be signing live on Twitch on March 7th at 12 p.m. Uh, March 7th. And if you want to see what the prints look like, I got you. Are you ready? Hold on, let me just wait one second. Let me just, let me just move this to the corner here. Hold on. Okay, so the first print that uh, I'll be signing is this one. Look at it. Isn't it pretty? I actually, so, okay, I, obviously I didn't draw this. Are you kidding me? This was drawn by uh, Soundless Wind um, on Twitter. Soundless Wind. Also, they go by Holly. Uh, their stuff is freaking amazing. And I fell in love with their work for the first time when I bought one of their prints at a convention. And, um... I saw that they were doing like print commissions and I, I had to. It's so pretty. I love it so much. Um, but yeah, this is one of the prints that'll be available on uh, Streamily. And uh, I love it a lot. Um, oh, whoops, that's not it. The, the second print that I'll be selling is actually one that I was selling at Comic-Con, except um, it'll be bigger because it, this one is being sold through Streamily. But it's this one, and this is one of the one I uh, I drew and then I posted because I was like, I'm gonna be selling this at Comic Con, and then a lot of people were like, Are you gonna sell it online at all? And I was like, Oh, I don't know, maybe. So this will be available for people who were interested in it. Um, yeah, this is in my like YouTube outfit, and then this is oh, I'm in the way. This is the uh, this is the third print that I'll be um selling and it's uh it's a it's a cheaper alternative because it is slightly smaller um but uh as as some of you may know we are we are cry positive here okay uh <laughs> i'm a i'm a strong believer of like you know using crying as like a as like a de-stressor um i know it's, it doesn't help everybody but i i'm a firm believer of like you shouldn't be shamed for expressing your feelings this way so that's that print. Okay, let me just move this out of the way. And this, and let me move over to the other just chatting screen. One second. Ah, hello. I know there's not much difference, um, except for like the, the lace in the chat box. So, okay, one second. All right, so I think, I think for the rest of the stream, I'll, I'll be like looking in the chat and um, probably, you know, answering some questions. I feel like I've answered a lot of the frequently asked questions, but if there's any specific questions that you have, uh, I am happy to answer them. It's a chill stream today. I'm not doing anything crazy. I know for debut streams, a lot of people like to, to sing because they're good at it. But I, I'm not good at it, so I'm not going <laughs> to sing this stream. I'm sorry. <laughs> um... Oh, let me see. Have you seen Treasure Planet? I did. I saw Treasure Planet like uh, last year, two years ago. You know, obviously like way too late, but um, I really liked it. Um, oh, <laughs> made myself big by accident. <laughs> uh, someone said, what mic do I use? All right. So I got a big boy upgrade. Are you ready for this? I got, I mean, I feel like this is the mic that a lot of people use, but I got the Shure SM7B. Uh, I had been using the same mic for the past, 
I want to say like four or five years. Like it had been with me since like basically I started. Um, and then I was like, okay, I feel like it's about time I upgraded my mic. So I did. And now it sounds nice and crisp. A lot of people are asking, are you going to stream Genshin? Yes, I will. Um, I, I, I think I'm going to save it. Oh, thank you, Beal, Beal Trap. Uh, I, I think I'll, I think I'll save it for when Ayato comes out. Wah! What's this? Huh? What? Cat and Raven designs? Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the, uh, the raid. My goodness. My birthday's tomorrow. Can you wish me a happy birthday? Of course. Happy birth- Ow! Happy birthday! I don't know how old you're turning, but I hope you have an amazing birthday. Um. Oh, what's this? Thanks! Thanks, Doss! What was I saying? Oh, hold on. Someone said, Hey, Emily, I'm down. Ah, I'm down today. I would cry, but I don't know. As a guy, I feel like I just gotta keep myself from it. And now, I don't know. Hope you have a great day. Love your videos a lot. You know, I've heard that a lot. I've met a bunch of guys who felt like they weren't allowed to cry because it was like emasculating. And I feel like a lot of guys get told by their parents that you shouldn't cry. You can cry, it's fine. You're not less of a man because you cry. <laughs> I don't know, that, like that makes me so upset because like I've met so many people who just like, even like, you know, even girls who were just told constantly that like, if you cry, that makes you weak. That doesn't make you weak at all. Like if, if you want to, it's okay. And you should be allowed to. Um, I cry all the time. I mean, not all. <laughs> wait, no, no, not all the time. Don't get the wrong idea. I don't cry all the time. But when I get really stressed out, it does make me feel better. And like, you know, I don't feel embarrassed by it or anything. It, I just, it's such a natural human thing to do. And you shouldn't feel ashamed for it. Someone said, no, nah, you cry all the time. No, I don't. <laughs> um... Oh, but back to the question about uh, whether I will be streaming Genshin. Yes, I think <laughs> I think I'll be I think I'll be waiting until Ayato comes out because I do I, I main I main Ayaka, so I need to I need to reunite the siblings together. Oh, oh, thank you, Bird. Congrats on the debut. Thank you. Whoa, wait, hold on. There's a long message. One second. Let me let me scroll up. Was there any cute VTuber video you had for your debut? If there is one, will it be posted on your YouTube channel? Um, unfortunately, I think I missed it. Um, I mean, aside from, like, uh, the video that I had already posted on my channel, um, I mean, I, I won't post anything else, but I do have a highlights channel and a VODs channel. Um, I should probably link that in my, uh, Twitch bio after this. But yeah, I, I have a highlights channel and a watch channel where um, my editor will be posting uh, all the bots and maybe a few highlights. Highlights take a little longer. Uh, oh, and I'm wondering why did you choose to work at a cafe and not use your magical girl character? Sorry if it's a weird question. Don't worry, it's not a weird question. Um, I, I feel like it takes a lot for me to think of a question as weird. I, I wanted to do a cafe just because, you know, I thought, well, since streaming is technically going to be like a side hobby slash side job, why not? <laughs> why not make it my uh, persona's part time job? And you know what? Maybe her other part time job is being a magical girl. Who knows? That's a good idea for for a, maybe like an alternate outfit. <sighs> let's see. Um... Let's see, let's see. Uh, hello, I've been subscribed to your YouTube channel for almost a year now and I love your videos so much. I, I can just relate to you so much and I really like your little avatar. Hope you have a great day. Oh, thank you, that's really sweet. I hope you have a good day too. Uh, for me, it's Sunday. Hope everyone has a nice, chill, relaxing Sunday. Uh, do you plan on playing the new Pokemon games when they come out, Scarlet and Violet? There's a new Pokemon, okay, I do, I do. Um. I was actually asking my mods a few weeks ago what Pokemon game I should play because I am actually not... I think I've only played like one Pokemon game in my entire life and that was like a decade ago and I played Leaf Green. Uh, but I really want to play some of these newer Pokemon games and I know there's a lot of like hype over the new starters on Twitter right now. And uh, yeah, I, I want to play it. Um, 
I want to get better acquainted with Pokemon because it was robbed from me when I was a child. Uh, let's see. Um, um, um. Mm. Would you ever cosplay your VTuber model? I would! Okay, obviously I'd have to like commission someone to make it because I don't know how to sew. And, um, yeah, it would. it's a very like specific design. But yeah, I would absolutely love to, to cosplay this model one day. I don't know when, but you know, one of these days I'd like to. Which starter will you pick? Probably the green cat. The other ones aren't really speaking to me very much. <laughs> um, someone said, oh, this is a good question. How will you balance streaming with your YouTube channel? Not trying to be rude, just genuinely curious because I personally have trouble budgeting my time. Uh, so I am only streaming like three times a week max. Um, and the way I'm going to manage it is like... I'm going to I'm going to try and go forward with the schedule for now, but if it's get if it's like truly getting in the way of me getting stuff done on like the YouTube end, then I'm going to have to stream less because, you know, I have to like sort out my priorities. And um Yeah, that's kind of it. I mean, so I don't stream for a long time. Some of you may have noticed that my streams rarely ever go past like 3 hours. Um I like doing just like you know, shorter streams, just like two hours out of my day. And then I could spend the rest of it, you know, working on my other obligations and stuff. I know, okay, I know lately it seems like all my attention is directed towards like specifically streaming, but that's only because I'm getting used to, I'm getting used to this. I'm slowly learning how everything works. And, um, yeah, and it's just, it's really exciting for me right now. But once, you know, things die down and it's, uh, it's a little more chill, uh, ow! <laughs> then, yeah, once I get more used to the routine of things, it should be easier for me to balance the two. Right now, my head's sort of, like, deep into, like, this streaming thing, only because everything is so new to me. <laughs> um, Mario fan, thank you. They said, Hi, Emmy, I enjoy your videos, and you're a really cool person. Hope to meet you and die to someday when this pandemic ends. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Um... If it's okay to ask, are you planning on doing a Discord channel for Twitch specifically? Uh, cause I've gotten this question a lot. Um, no, I don't plan on making a public Discord server. Uh, I, I feel like it would just sort of be a little overwhelming to have to manage an entire Discord server, like in addition to Twitch and YouTube. And also, I honestly, I've heard like way too many horror stories about Discord from like my peers. And it's, I'm going to be honest, it sort of scared me off from, like, considering making a Discord channel. So, like, I have one for my mods, for, like, general mod stuff, but um, I, I have no plans to, to make a Discord. Uh, oh, hi, Emmy. I really like your videos, and I've been following you as long as I remember. You're my number one inspiration, and I've been improving my art since 2017. Oh, thank you! Aw, I'm, I'm happy to hear that. Uh, I can be any any kind of inspiration. Um, let's see. Uh, sorry if I'm getting a little personal. Oh, no worries. But in the debut announcement, you mentioned you were moving. Same city, new city, state, country. Oh. You know what? I have never seen Ruby. Uh, my roommates are actually super into Ruby, or I think they were. I don't know if they still watch it, but they really like it. And um, you know what? Maybe, maybe I'll, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll consider watching it. I've, I've never considered it before, but if it's, is it good? I have, I've never seen anything from Ruby. I think I've seen like one fight scene, and it was really cool. Um, oh, back to the moving question. Um, I will be in a different city. Um. Yeah, but you'll find out. You'll you'll find out where once I once I like make a video. But yeah, I'll be in a different city. Um Let's see, let's see. Um Hey, can we get a Pikachu? I heard you can do a good one. Okay. I even though I do have the the Pikachu thing as like a channel redeem because this is my official debut stream, I will give you one. <laughs> I will, I will give you, I will give you one Pikachu. 
just because it like it makes me cringe a little to do it, but I'll 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 do it. <coughs> God. There you go. Hope you hope you enjoyed. Um <laughs> Pikachu points for team win. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, let's see. What's what's this? What's this comment? Hey, Emmy, I have watched your videos since college. Will you be streaming art or mainly not art? Keep up the good work. Oh, thank you. Um, I will be streaming art. I actually have streamed art a few times. Um. I have to figure out like the tracking for when I when I uh, when I draw because I look down when I draw and it makes my model kind of like go all wonky. So I'll have to figure that out. But yeah, I do. I have done a few drawing streams. Um, they've been a lot of fun. Usually how it goes is I'll do the sketch and the line art and like a little bit of the flat coloring on stream and then I'll finish it off stream um, and then I'll post it. So, you know, streaming drawings have uh, have sort of like helped me draw more personal art i feel like usually when i draw i feel pressured to like have to make it into like a video or something or draw for only my videos but i like doing like fan art on occasion too um let's see uh oh i got some interesting questions oh wait oh <laughs> stigger lloyd says i literally haven't been on twitch in months and you're here it says you brought back so many happy memories for me thank you. I haven't seen you in a while. Hope you're doing well because you literally raised me as No, don't say that. I don't want to feel old. <laughs> but thank you. I appreciate it. That's really sweet. <laughs> no. No. Uh, someone asked, "Does your parent do your parents support what you do?" That is a very interesting question. Um, yes, they do actually. Uh, so funny enough, um they were really pushing me to be Oh, Thank you, so thank you, Sulky Cats, for the host slash raid. Thank you. Um, yes, my parents do support what I do. Uh, my my dad, I think, is one of my number one fans. Uh, <laughs> my my older brother Josh said that when he went to visit my parents in Korea, he was really creeped out because in the mornings my dad would just like put on a playlist of all my videos and just blast them. Like you could mute them, but he would like blast them. And so my brother would wake up in the morning to like the sound of my voice. <laughs> and, uh, um, but yeah, at the, so at the beginning, I actually didn't tell my parents uh, because I have Asian parents. And, you know, when you tell your Asian parents about your personal ambitions, um, when there hasn't been any like fruit on the vine yet, they, they, they try their best to discourage you. And I didn't want to be discouraged. So I actually waited until... Um, I think I waited till I hit like 200k subs and I was like making some money when I, when I started making like a little bit of money on YouTube. That's when I was like, guess what, mom and dad, I'm not going to get into teaching. I'm actually going to do YouTube and uh, I'm making money. So you can't say no. And they were like, oh, OK. <laughs> and uh, yeah. And now like it's it's really sweet. I appreciate my parents a lot. Um, they've told me. Like they, they've told me many times that they feel regretful that they didn't, uh, they didn't like support my like artistic endeavors when I was younger. Like they, they didn't really push it. My parents are the type who were like, yeah, drawing is a fun hobby, but like we want you to like play piano or like go to a good school and become like this occupation. Yeah, you guys know how it is. Uh <laughs> but yeah, um, I appreciate them. It's really sweet they they've told me like oh, i wish i wish i'd supported like you drawing more when you were younger and i'm like it's okay because you know i was so stubborn that i just kept doing it and here i am <laughs> uh will you turn any moments on twitch into a main channel video you mean like a video on like my actual main like emerichu channel um Probably not my main channel because I did promise everyone that I was going to keep them separated. But the highlights and stuff, they, it already has its own channel. Um, I have highlights channel. Uh, it should be linked in my uh, main YouTube channel page. But also after the stream, I will link the two in my uh, actual Twitch bio. But yeah, they'll have two separate channels. 
Um, <laughs> someone said, "Why is it always the piano?" I know <laughs> they they also tried the oboe. Okay, that that didn't work out. I hated the oboe. <laughs> <laughs> um Can you do an ara <sighs> I I knew someone was going to ask. All right, listen, chat. <laughs> chat. Listen. It is a redeem. It is a very like high redeem, I admit. But if you okay, do you <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I've never, I've never really, I've never really like done one for chat. Okay, I'm considering being charitable and giving you a free one because it's debut, and I feel like it's a rite of passage in the in VTubing culture. But if it'll make you stop asking, I will give you. <laughs> I will give you one. God damn. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, 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 okay. Damn, why is this so nerve wracking? Okay. Ara ara. There you go. Have fun. <laughs> that's it. That's your one. That's your one free one. Okay. Enjoy. All right, let me let me. See. <laughs> I'm gonna drink some water. All right, your free trial of Ada has ended. <laughs> Can we also get one free? Ooh, you guys want just a, like a free? Okay, you know what? You know what? For the debut, I will give you one free of everything. But first, do you guys want to see what the free like high cost uh, bully the waitress looks like? Are you ready for this? Okay, where is this? What is this? Where is this? Okay, this is what you can get for twenty five thousand channel points. I don't know. I don't know how long you have to sit in a stream for to get that many, but here is the highest level of bullying the waitress. <laughs> it literally moves my model. <laughs> Can you dodge it? No, I can't. I'm sorry. Ah! <laughs> ow, ow. No, why? What have I what have I done? <laughs> oh, it's a sound miss. Oh. oh wait. Have you guys not been able to hear the sound of the, the smacking this whole time? Wait, what? You ah, you guys haven't been able to hear What? It's been quiet. No! Wait! Are you serious? That means that like people who are just listening to my stream every time I got hit by something and I was like, ah, they must have been like, what is wrong with her? No! Okay, well, you know, ow. That was, yeah, that was meant to have a, <sighs> yes, there were sounds. As as per Emery to stream tradition, you can't have a stream without something being accidentally muted. All right, you know what? I'll do the I'll do redeem again. I'll do the I'll do it again because it's a lot funnier with sound. <laughs> Smack. All right, here you go. Here's another one. <laughs> Oh, now, now I feel bad. You guys couldn't hear the smacks at the beginning. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. <laughs> the scuff is inevitable. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What, what other free redeem is there? Let's see. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, another. 
I guess this is the time for me to advertise the, the channel point redeems. All right, you can redeem. You can redeem. You, you guys are asking for more and more. <laughs> no! Okay. So you guys know, uh, you guys know how like in, in like maid cafes or like the, the stereotypical thing is they're like, I will bless your food. And then they, and then they, they do the thing, you know, you've seen it in like k and stuff. That is also a redeem. If you feel so compelled. I I'm not going to do it though. <laughs> I feel like, I, I feel like the, the, the last thing I did for free d d d d took, sapped all my energy. You want, you want a free, you want a free uwu? Chili, wait, give it to us, it's debut? <sighs> but why add it on your points? Because I've noticed that people love to spend channel points if it means tormenting the streamer. So, ah! So I figured it was more than appropriate. Um. Uh, um. Hold on. Thank God for debut. <laughs> <laughs> One. All right. The thing is, I feel like there's so many people who have such a visceral reaction to like uwu voices that I'll like everyone will leave as soon as I do it. Will I do a karaoke stream? <sighs> I will think about it, but I don't know because I, I don't, I don't, I don't, uh, I don't really sing, and I feel like I'd be too nervous to sing in front of however many of you there are. Do the uwu. Okay, what do you want me to say, chat? I'll, I'll do the goddamn uwu voice. What do you want me to say? <laughs> Watch the viewer count drop. No, don't go. <laughs> what do I? What do I? Okay, give me a sentence to say in in an uwu voice. It's a free trial of what you can expect if you redeem if you redeem the uwu point thing. What do the Navy Seal copy pasta? What is that? Hold on, let me look that up. The Navy Seal coffee pasta. Is that the listen here, you little sh- Ah, oh, I thought so. <laughs> Please! <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> you guys ready for... The Navy Seal co uh, coffee pasta? I'm only gonna do like one sentence. I'm not gonna do the whole thing. No, I'm not doing the whole thing. Jesus. Alright, let's say Let's see here. <laughs> what the fuck did you just say about me, you little bitch? I'll have you know I graduated top of my class in the Navy Seals. <laughs> no! <laughs> alright, alright, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough mental damage, okay? For you guys. And that's my cue to leave. No, don't go, please. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you for this sub, man. I really, I I was not expecting to get bullied this much in my debut, but I I don't know what I expected. Oh wait, can Shroomy zero zero cosplay your model? They keep asking, but you don't seem to notice. Oh. I'm sorry chat's going really fast it's it's easy to to miss um but yes if you want to cosplay my model i would be honored that would be uh amazing thank you um but yeah if if you if you if you want to yeah if you you don't need to get my permission for that kind of thing like it, it's totally fine um let's see there is a lot Oh, Das, I'm so sorry. I don't have text-to-speech enabled for, for tips. I think I, I forgot to. I'm sorry. I see what you were trying to do there, though. <laughs> um, okay. There was another... I'm trying to... There was another, like, message I saw, but I keep missing it because... It's just going too fast. Let me see. Um, oh. I've been considering doing YouTube, like, video games, to be honest. I'm not good at games whatsoever. I've been told this before, too. But anyways, what would you say was the hardest part when you started YouTube? Ah, the hardest part when I started YouTube. 
Hmm. The hardest part? What was that? I don't know, because like, the beginning of, of YouTube felt like such a fever dream that I, I can't remember a whole lot. Um, like, I just remember it was like a, it was a really fun experience. I feel like the hard part, the hard part started happening, like, after my channel started gaining traction. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I, you know what? The hardest part when I started out was just trying to, like, figure out, like, I, I don't know, like, how to post or, like, how YouTube worked. I, I think, I think that's, you know what? I don't, I don't really remember. I, I'm sorry. I have such a bad answer. But I, I remember it was, it was really, it was really fun. I mean, it's still fun, but it was extra fun in the, in the beginning when everything was so new to me. Um... Uh, oh, hello, Emery. I think I saw you when you did collab with Sif Athiana, but I could be wrong. No, you're right, I did. My question is something I asked here before, but how do you make the slides and use it in the background? Okay, so the way I did my slides in particular was, um, I actually, so each, each slide I saved as an image. And then if you go into OBS, uh, you can add a source. And I added an image slide source. And so you can, you can add like, a ton of um different drawings like or not drawings different images in order and then you can use the arrow keys to like go through each one and that's how i did it um i don't know how other people do it but that's how i did it i just used it as like a image source what did you think about boobies debut <gasps> i thought it was amazing the the production quality uh, did you guys see it were you guys there yesterday? Oh my god, it was amazing. It was fantastic. Everyone who was involved in that, like, project did a fantastic job. Um, yeah, praise King Booby. <laughs> oh, thank you, Marmy. <laughs> um, yeah, I was so, so, I was so surprised when I saw that Meriwether did the lore video. Uh, he did phenomenal. Everyone involved did an amazing job. It was a really good debut. Yeah, he did kill it. All right, Ugh, hold on, I need water. Ugh. Are you gonna collab or plan on collaborating anytime soon? Yeah, I mean, okay, so if, if uh, other creators want to collab, like feel free to reach out, but uh, I actually do have a collab coming tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to be playing Phasmophobia with Chili and Wolfie 2, uh, who you guys might be familiar with. Uh, I have not played Phasmophobia in a very long time. So I'm kind of excited to see what the new updates are like. Uh, but yeah, the first horror stream. Oh, just a reminder for those of you who are not familiar. Um, I scream a lot. When I, well, I mean, when I play games in general, but especially horror games. So I'm just giving you a headphone warning or just a warning in general. I might scream a lot. Uh, I'm going to try not to. I'm going to try my hardest because uh, I know that, like, I know screaming can get really annoying really quickly. So I'm going to try to, like, <laughs> hold back as much as I can. But I can't promise anything because it is a scary game and I don't do well in uh, scary environments. Hi, Emmy. I've heard you liked anime and I want to ask if you have seen Toilet Bound Hanako-kun. Oh, you know what? Ah, I've seen clips from Hanako-kun and I, do, I don't know anything about the story, but the art looks so pretty and I, I do want to see it just for the art alone. Um... Oh, hey Emily, greetings from Germany. Hello, do you maybe know how international your subscribers are? I'm actually not sure how international, but I, I am really surprised every time someone uh, is like, oh, hey, greetings from like, insert country I've never been to before. Uh, thank you so much for watching my stuff and I appreciate it. And I don't know what time it is for you over there, but I appreciate you for catching my stream. Um, let's see. Emily, I've been watching- oh! Thank you. For the five sub- or, yeah, five- five gifted subs. Lord- Lord of Fall? Lord of Fall? Anyways, uh, KK Lip asked, Hey, Emery2, I've been watching your channel for a few- 
Yeah, a few years now. And you're awesome. Thank you. I had about when you were... Oh, I heard about when you were going to be a teacher. I'm looking into becoming a teacher. And what would you say it was the hardest part about studying in that field? The hardest part? Okay. Well, I, I think if you genuinely want to be a teacher, I think our hardest parts are very different. Um, For me, the hardest part was, I guess, like trying to convince myself that this was something I really wanted to do. Um, I uh, like the like the classes, the major itself. It, it wasn't like super difficult. Probably the hardest part was when we had to get like on field, like in classroom experience. And you had to like actually like work with kids and like because kids are, you know, they're unpredictable. No matter how much you learn in class about like kids and like how to deal with them. The hardest part is when you have to like actually work with them and then you get used to like obviously you get used to it but you know I've had third graders make me cry before <laughs> it's that was probably the hardest part but you learn you learn and um it is really fulfilling but I near the end of my college life I realized that what I truly wanted to do was draw so I I didn't I didn't hate like teaching or anything. It was it was a good time, but it wasn't something that I wanted to like pursue career wise. Uh, oh, is it slightly tilted? I think I'm just in real life slightly tilted to the right. Um, let's see. Whoa, there's oh gosh, there's so much here. Uh, hi Emmy, do you plan on streaming Genshin? Yes, when Ayato comes out, I would like to stream Genshin. Um, but also the Genshin community scares me a little bit. Uh, I, I don't know what'll set them off, but I, yeah, you know what? Maybe I'll do like a Genshin stream or two. Um, hi, Emery2. Speaking about international fans. Hello from Lebanon. Oh, hello. Hi. Um, let's see. Uh, okay, wait, hold on. How much longer am I going to stream today? Honestly, probably not much longer. Uh, just for like a, a little bit. Um, and I'm going to end and like finish drawing some stuff and then finish moving and packing. I've, you know, I've, I've got a got a busy week ahead of me, but yeah, I'm, I'm probably just going to chill out here for just a little while longer. Um, let's see. Oh, ah, thank you for the five gifted. Do you think you'll ever play Cooking Mama? I really liked the Cooking Mama games and they were on like the 3DS. I don't really, uh, this might be a hot take. I don't really like how the new one looks. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's cause like Mama's in like 3D or something. Um, I'm not really, I'm not really into it though. <laughs> hey Emily, do you plan on playing Dark Souls? <sighs> My roommate Moon keeps telling me that I should. But I feel like I'd be really bad at it. Um, Elden Ring came out not too long ago, right? I don't, I don't know. I, I feel like I, I wouldn't even get it past like the tutorial phase if there even is one. I've never played. Oh, I've never played Dark Souls. Any weird slash creepy fan experiences recently or lately? Recently, lately? No, not at all. Um, yeah, I haven't really had that many in general. Uh, yeah, when I went to Comic Con. Uh, recently, I didn't, I don't recall ever have like getting put off by anybody. So yeah, it's been like mostly a really good experience. Um, hey, Emily, big fan of your content. What is one thing that you wish you did when starting your YouTube channel? <sighs> um, hmm. What would I have done differently? Maybe I would have like picked a different name. I... <laughs> Like, I like my current name, but I, I feel a lot more people have trouble, like, saying it than I thought they would. So, like, sometimes I'll, I'll meet people in real life and they'll be like, are you Emichiru? And I'm like, sure. <laughs> I'm sure. We could say, Close enough. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe I would have picked, like, a different name. Obviously, it's too late to go back. And, like, I don't hate it. So I, there's not much else I would have changed, to be honest. Um... Ah, wah, 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 wah. I hope your process of moving goes well. Thank you, I appreciate it. 
Uh, hi, Emily. What do you use for drawing? I use a Huion canvas. Oh, I used to use a Huion. Um, I actually, I used a Huion for like four years. I used it for a long ass time. And then I upgraded um, at the insistence of some of my friends because they were like, Emily, you need to upgrade. And I'm like, oh, okay. So I upgraded and I think I use a, a, a Wecom now, but I think, I think they're both good. I don't know really like if there's like a huge difference, but the people swear by it. Um, greetings from Canada. How do you read the chat as it goes by so fast? Oh, well, thank you. I, I was worried that I wasn't reading it fast enough. Well, okay, so I'll like, I have to scroll down and I'll pause and I'll read. So I'm actually like a little bit lagging behind, to be honest. Um, but I'm trying my best. I'm trying. I didn't expect there to be this many people. <laughs> Hello, Emily. Your voice is so nice. Thank you. So I was wondering, will you please sing a song for it? No. <laughs> I, I can't sing. Well, okay. Well, no. No. Mm, no, not really. I... Uh, you know, maybe I'll, like, join a friend's karaoke stream one day. Or, like, maybe I'll, like, have one just for fun. But, uh, I... I can't sing. Um, <laughs> I've never been... I've never really been able to. Uh, but thank you. I, I appreciate the compliment. Um... <laughs> okay, let me let me scroll down. Let me catch up. Let me catch up. For the debut, Emily, I've already given you so much for the debut. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, wait, did Booby also say he wasn't gonna sing? Huh, interesting. Um Karaoke stream, a hundred million channel points. <laughs> <laughs> you know, hmm. No, I don't know if I'll ever feel like I already feel super nervous just talking to talking on stream. I mean, I've gotten used to it, but still really nervous. I can't imagine like trying to sing on stream. Good Lord. Um, hello, Emily. I hope this doesn't make me sound like a sadist, but I enjoy it when you scream in scary games. I record the screams and then use them as an alarm for my friends. I hope life is treating you well. <laughs> Thank you. You know what I wanted to do, actually? So you know how for, like, some horror games, people will include, um... What is it? They'll include, like, like bit rewards where it plays a scary noise. I considered making one of the sounds, like, my own scream. Like, startling myself with my own scream. <laughs> is there gonna be a Yandere redeem? What does that even mean? Like, we just I just act like a Yandere for, like, five minutes? I'll like threaten you if you go to any other cafe, I guess. <laughs> Emily, will you play Doki Doki Literature Club? I've actually already played Doki Doki Literature Club. Like, God, when did that game come out again? Like 2016, 2017? Um, yeah, I played it when it when it first came out, but I don't think I was really doing YouTube then. Was I? You know what? I don't remember. But I I wasn't I've already played it. It's been spoiled. <laughs> Um. Oh. Okay. Oh my gosh, Emily, is that you? Yes, it's me. Hi. Um. I think it's really, I think it's really funny when when people discover this uh, Twitch channel, not not from any of my social media, but they just discover it on Twitch, and they're like, Emily. <laughs> and I'm like, hello, it's me. <laughs> Uh, someone said, I bet it costs a lot to be a VTuber, especially having your model being made professionally. Yeah, um, I, I, I would say uh, VTubing is an investment. Es like, especially, like, I know there's VTubers who draw their own stuff, and honestly, I admire them so much, and I commend them. Um, but, <coughs> what the? Al Abduli. Thank you for the 30 gifted. Jesus, what the hell? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, oh my god, I lost my train. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, VTubing is a bit of an investment, especially if you want to uh, like commission a lot of uh, different artists. However, if you're getting started and you don't want to spend too much, um, 
don't worry there there's like a lot of like free assets for people who just want to like try it out and they don't want to spend like a ton of money on it like obviously if you want something super customized to you then that's when like it sort of is expensive but there's a lot of free assets um that that are that are made by wonderful artists so emmy on a scale of one to ten how excited are you for the tokyo Mew, Mew remake okay all right here we go all right, this is kind of a hot take, but um, I'm I okay. I'm def I'm really excited for it because Tokyo Mew Mew was such a big part of my childhood. But I'm not super. Oh, <laughs> great ghost! Thank you for the fifty subs. What the fuck? <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm sorry, I cursed. Thank you, thank you. Ah, Jesus! Great ghost! Thank you. Um. Yeah, as I was saying, I'm not I'm not that excited for the design. Like I'm not into the designs, the redesigns. I don't know if maybe I'm like really attached to the old Tokyo Mimi designs, but it's uh it's it feels a bit like a downgrade, but I'm still going to watch it. Like obviously I'm going to watch it. I want to support it. I want to give it a chance because uh I I really love Tokyo Mimi. But I'm just, I'm not feeling the, the redesigns very much. Um, thank you, so Sophie, Sophiniel, Sophiniel, thanks for the sub. Okay, so I think I will end stream in like five minutes or so. I know today was like a really short stream, but I didn't expect my presentation to end so quickly. Um, and, uh... Yeah, I'll, you know what? I'll give it like five more minutes. <laughs> Thank you to everyone who showed up. I appreciate you tons. Um, hello, I have a quick question. How did you come up with your YouTube name? Also love your artwork. Thank you. So the way I came up with my name was I had been using like MED for all of my like handles for like everything for a while when I was in high school. And then I tried to make a Tumblr and someone had took the name MED and I was like, well, shit what am i supposed to do and i think i wanted to add like a something cute at the end like maybe like a like a kiss so i was like oh chew and also i uh my friends were like oh you do a really good pikachu impression you should just like you're like pikachu but emily and i'm like yeah that makes sense and <laughs> that's how it happened <laughs> Uh, okay. Um. Hmm? I gave up trying to get you to notice me. What are you talking about, minnow fish? I just noticed you. There's there's a lot of people in chat. Okay, my eyes can only read so fast. <laughs> Ace Killer King. Um. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? What? Where'd it go? Oh. Oh, can you draw a piece of art of you and one of my avatars? Uh, yeah, you know what? If you tag me in what your avatar looks like, I could save it for a doodle stream. Um, so that... No, I'm not reading that. <laughs> <laughs> ah, thank you, I love Dooley, for the sub. Read faster? I'm trying! <laughs> Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Have I watched Attack on Titan? No, I haven't. Um, I hear it's really good, but I've, uh, I've I've never watched it. I'm sorry. Um, I don't. It just I, I don't do well with super violent shows. <laughs> I say as I am also uh, keeping up with Demon Slayer. <laughs> Who is best girl in Konosuba? Um. As much as I would, <laughs> as much as I would love to say Aqua, I think true best girl has to be Union, hundred percent. Union best girl, uh, second best girl is Aqua. <laughs> Going to play the new Kirby. I actually, I've never played a Kirby game. I really do. That is one of my goals. Play more games. I wanna. I do want to play a Kirby game at some point. Hmm. Oh, thank you for the sub. 
Oh, I like this question. What's your favorite part about cons? Be safe at VidCon. I hope to go next year. Thank you. Oh, yeah, I forgot. That's another announcement I forgot. I am a featured creator at VidCon this year uh, in June uh, 2022. Yeah, that's this year. That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, my favorite part about cons... <laughs> Oh Jesus! My favorite. <laughs> what? <laughs> my favorite. My favorite part about cons was well, okay. Specifically, anime cons. I love going to the artist alley. Oh my! <laughs> Alep Dooley, thank you for the 16 gifted subs. You don't have to do that. <laughs> um, my favorite part is the artist alley, but cons in general. Like if I'm guesting, my favorite is you know like meeting ah. Meeting, meeting some of my subscribers, you know, finally putting like a face to the name. It's a lot of fun. Ow! Uh, the last, ah, the last con I went to, I had an amazing time because everyone was so sweet. It was, it was really good. I've missed cons. Okay. Ah! All right. I think it is a good time. Oh, do you have somewhere where you could send fan art? Yes! Um, if you just use the hashtag, uh, hashtag Emmerichu and also hashtag Emmerilust, uh, I guess that one is, is still a work in progress. Um, uh, I will see the fan art there, but also you can uh, at me directly on Twitter, but I think it's better to use the hashtag. Um, okay, I think this is a good stop. <laughs> I, I think this is a good stopping point. Um, I don't know how long I've been streaming for, but uh, I... Yeah, I think this is a good stopping point. I'd like to say thank you to everyone who uh, showed up to my debut. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me let me just show my model one last time because you probably won't see like my legs or anything for a while. Ah! And yeah, little strawberry laces, the the bow on the back, and yeah. Um, I'm gonna be ending stream now. I, I hope everyone had an amazing time. The cafe is now closing. And uh, I hope you guys have an amazing Sunday. And I look forward to tomorrow. Thank you so much. Uh, goodbye.